Hey YouTube, Keegan here from Textures U, and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys the Cydia tweak for iPad called Full Force by Ryan Petrich. I am very excited to do this video because it is the first time in a long time we have been able to do tweak videos. With the new iOS 7 jailbreak, we are now going to be able to bring you many more tweak videos in the upcoming weeks and months. I'm sure you're familiar with the way that iPhone apps are run on the iPad. The iPad is able to emulate an iPhone app that is not optimized for iPad so that it can still run and be used. Now it is not ideal and as you guys can see here I'm using the Kickstarter app which is only available for iPhone. Now I'm running it in the emulator and as you can see it looks like the iPhone app would. It is sort of smaller in the center and there if I reduce it to a regular size that is how it looks on the iPad. Now it looks pixelated and the keyboard is kind of funny and there are just a lot of things wrong with using it like this. But with this new tweak called Full Force you are able to actually scale that up accurately to fit the iPad and it looks like it's a native app. Now within the settings you can enable the applications that it detects are iPhone only. In this example I'll be using Kickstarter as I said before. Now what you're going to want to do is go ahead and quit the app that your ad is running so that you can get a clean start and relaunch it. Once you relaunch the app, you'll notice right away that it looks quite different. As you can see here, it looks like it was designed for the iPad. Now this is very cool because until now, this hasn't really been possible, especially not on iOS 7. Now what this does is it basically just rearranges the elements on the screen and expands the elements that it can to fill up the screen. Now it has some issues, as you can see here, there is some overlapped text and overlapped images, but they are fairly minor and especially in this app it works quite well. Here I can go to my profile and I can actually see the projects I've backed. Here is the Zen Multifunctional Touch Pen, which by the way I recommend you guys check out on Kickstarter, it is an awesome new stylus for your iPad. Now as you can see here I can view all of the backing information and all of the rewards and prices, and it takes up the entire screen and does not waste any space. I was actually very pleasantly surprised to see how well videos play back in this app as well. As you can see here, the video does take up the entire width and it plays back without any issues. And another issue with the iPhone emulator is the keyboard. Now it tries to emulate the actual iPhone keyboard which is very difficult for typing on. Now what this does is as you can see here it puts a text area in the middle for sending a message and then it uses the native iOS 7 iPad keyboard which is much much easier for typing on as opposed to the emulated iPhone keyboard. Now this tweak is available for jailbroken devices and it does work with iOS 7. In this video I'm going to walk you through the installation process and how exactly you install it. And it is actually very simple. You're simply going to go into the search section on Cydia and type in full force. Now this is on one of the main repos which you'll see in a moment so it does show up in search without having to do anything. As you can see right here the first option is full force from the big boss repo and this is the version that you want to install. You simply you're going to click on the install button in the top right. Now this is available for iOS 7 and it works on the Retina iPad 4 which is what I'm using it on and it should work on other iPads as well. Now because I already have it installed in the top right I only have the modify option but I'll go ahead and reinstall now so I can show you exactly how easy it is to install. I'll go ahead and click on reinstall and you can see it is only about 29 kilobytes. When you tap install it runs the Cydia installer and then you need to respring your device. Now this only takes a few seconds so this is a great tweak because it is very fast to install and it doesn't really take any time at all out of your day to install but it does add a lot of functionality to your iPad and it is definitely a tweak that I don't think I could live without now that I have discovered it. As I said, this tweak is Full Force by Ryan Petrich, and it is available in the Big Boss Cydia repo. I will have all that information for you in the description section below. I hope you find this video useful, and I hope you're looking forward to our new tweak videos as much as I am. This has been Keegan from Tech Shows U, and I will see you next time.